Hey everyone, I'm Tammy. Welcome to my channel. Today, I want to do a fall home tour. Some of y'all have been asking for that, and I was planning on doing it anyway. So, we'll just get started. This home is a 2014 double-wide manufactured home. Our house that we had burned in 2014, and we, instead of rebuilding, went back with a mobile home and we bought it new and we bought it to our specifications we had rooms turned around and different things added one of the things we added was the fireplace and i want to show you some of the things i've got decorated for fall and really just show you around a little bit so we'll get started this is our fireplace and i have a banner that me and my aunt made and then there is a mantle and the hearth the candles that I have on the hearth the black candle holder I got at Salvation Army for $1.99 and I have just tea light candles in that and I also have a lantern that a friend gave me. We have shelves on both sides of our fireplace. And if you see any blank spots, it's where I had family photos. But I have taken those down for privacy reasons. This is a big old comfortable chair that I bought new with a big ottoman and the end table with a green cloth on it is my husband's little corner it's a little messy right now but I'll go ahead and show it to you he has a recliner that he sits in On the other end table, I've got a pumpkin basket that I got at the thrift store. I have my sewing basket on the shelf. There's our ash bucket. So when we use our fireplace, we use wood and we put our ashes in there. We don't need it today though. It's about 80 degrees here in Alabama today. This is the other built-in. I just have some of my favorite books on that. And you'll see that one shelf is pretty blank. I had a lot of family photos there. There's an antique clock and some candles. That's the door going into our restroom, our community bath. This is our sofa. And it's a big sofa and it gets a lot of use with children and grandchildren in and out it's just me and my husband that live here you can see the dining room table on this wall of the living room I have a little end table this is usually where I sit in this love seat and those little vegetables that have are sitting in the love on the love seat are off of my wreath the hot glue on my wreath is letting things fall off of it because the it gets so hot at our front door but i'll show you our front door there's the wreath i was talking about it may get a little dark I'll take you and show you our front porch. Oh, I have a big clock. I do want to show you that. I have a big clock my husband got me for Christmas last year. And I just love it on that wall. 
and I love this love seat. It matches the gray in my big sofa. And in that chair, that big fluffy chair, there's a little bit of my front porch. You see I have a little fountain out there. That's a solar fountain. And I just made it out of a wash tub, put some greenery in it, have a few little sunflowers. There's that picture. I don't know. You can't see that picture very well because it's so dark. But that's a picture that I picked up in the mountains. We're going to go into the dining room. That's the door that leads to my bedroom. I can show you a little bit of it before we go in the dining room. Just bear with me. I'm trying not to let this camera jiggle too much. I'm going to have to raise it up real high. There we go. This is my bedroom. You see I have my dresser with all my little whatnots on it. I have a fan. I have to sleep with a fan at night. Me and my husband both. And then there's our bed. We have a queen size bed. Try to get a better picture of it. Those double doors go to our master bath. Uh-oh. Sorry, y'all. Let's look at some of the things I have on my dresser. I have a little ballerina doll that I have sitting up there with some of my costume jewelry on it. I have a caboodle with some makeup in it. My mother gave me that plaque that says, I love you to the moon and back. Then there's my perfumes. And I do have to store my sewing machine in here. So that's where I store my sewing machine. I'm going to redo my closet. And when I do, the sewing machine and the table are going into the closet. My aunt gave me that sign. That's a closet. And then I bought this sign on Facebook Marketplace. There's my dining room. And that I got at the Dollar Tree. I thought it was so cute. I have a four poster bed. Maybe you can tell more about my comforter if I go back this way. Yes. And Snoopy sleeps on my bed. I love Snoopy. I made that cross on the wall out of broken glass. There's my peacock pictures. And I just got this comforter from Overstock.com. It's supposed to look like ticking, the fabric ticking. And I just love it. It's so soft. So we'll go back into the other room so we can see the dining room. This is my dining room. We bought our table and china cabinet second hand. And I just love it because it's so big. I'm actually probably going to get rid of the china cabinet. I want a buffet, a big buffet to put there. And some of you have already noticed the sewing machine. When I film my videos, a lot of times I'm sitting in front of it. That was my great-grandmother's. That's the antique clock that we picked up in some yard sale stuff. I bought that family picture at the thrift store. 
And here are my bats. I made those out of egg cartons. I painted them black, put some eyes on them, and hung them from my light fixture. My husband bought this shelf for me. It's over in the corner. And I have it really decked out for fall. There's the top of it. And I have some candles, some battery operated candles, and some pictures that I've picked up at yard sales. And those little pumpkins, the white ones and the orange ones, they came from Target Dollar Spot. I have a little antique mirror on that shelf. And I see my candles leaning. I need to work on that. And then I have a big soup terrain and a lantern and a small soup terrain on that bottom shelf. I have it fixed pretty good with some pumpkins. Those are uh, like glass pumpkins and a candy jar and that white turkey. I think that was a teapot. It just is missing the lid, so I just stuck some floral in there. And I have a few odd and end things from the Dollar Tree. My deep freeze is in here right now, but I'm redoing my back porch and hopefully I'll be able to move that soon. And I want to show you a picture that my grandson made. Well. That's a haunted house that he drew. And I thought it was so cute. So he made me that decoration for Halloween. These French doors go out to my back porch. I just have a little simple wreath on it. Here's my table. And I do have my pilgrims out. When I decorate for fall, I just go ahead and put Thanksgiving out too. And I have a runner. I think I got that at, uh, I can't remember where I got that, a department store somewhere. So I just love that. That tray there is a homemade tray that my aunt and uncle made for me. You can pull the door too. This is my husband's shelf. He has some of his things up there. This is over by the kitchen. That's the entrance to the back door. And we keep our keys there. And I have a file picture and he has some of his little collectibles up there. On um, That shelf was made out of barn wood. And then here's where we put our shoes when we come in the door. I do have a case of water sitting there. We live in this home. I do keep a clean home, but I'm not a perfect housekeeper by no means. There's the bar. And I just have some decorations on it. And that basket has hand sanitizer in it, so anybody that needs it can come in and use it. I love my Lord Have Mercy sign. That's one of the first things I bought after my house burned. And I got it at Cracker Barrel. And it was like $6, something like that. Here's my kitchen. There's a village that I have, a fall village. There's my coffee bar. I'll try to get a closer up of this. This is just a counter. I have plenty of 
cabinets, plenty of cabinet space. We'll go into the kitchen now. You see right in front of you, that's the breakfast nook. I'll take you down there and show you it. I film a lot of videos at that table too. I just have a bamboo plant on it. And there's the outside. And there's my calendar. And here's my cabinet that I'm going to put my prepping supplies in. That's a sign up above it that a friend gave me. It says it is well with my soul, and it is. I have a lantern. And that's just my little vine plant that I have growing in water. My Pioneer Woman teapot. And this is the cabinet that I'm going to put my preps in. I've showed this on one of my videos before. I've got to clean it out. It just has odd and end stuff in it. And as you see in the corner, that's some of my groceries that I have bought that I've used for my stockpile. I'm going to back up and let you see this little white cabinet. I got it at an estate sale for $10. It's got a glass front. And I just love it. And this is a sore spot in my kitchen. It's a little basket that I keep some of my dish towels in. And then I have a bunch of stuff underneath it. And that really needs to be cleaned up. So, like I said, we live here. And you're going to see some things that maybe are out of place. That's my dish drainer. I have some dishes that I washed. I do have a dishwasher, but I still hand wash a lot of my dishes. There's my counter. And there's my chili fixings. I'm going to make my husband some chili after a while. And my crock pot. there you see the dining room again and here's my stove I have some sweet potatoes that I bought yesterday and I have a little wax burner that looks like a pumpkin I got it at a yard sale for a dollar a dollar I think it was it was a really good buy on that it's got a lid on it and you can take the lid off and I have Scentsy Baked Apple Pie in it. And it smells so good. And there's my stove. The appliances are black. It's my microwave. More cabinets. This is my refrigerator. And I usually have pictures of my grandchildren up there, but I've taken those down for privacy sake. This is my big pantry. And it's really big. I've got two double doors there. And then two double doors there all the way to the floor. So I love it. Got some stuff on top of my fridge. Some antique bowls and corning ware. So this is it, y'all. This is my kitchen. There's our vitamins. I have a pretty dishcloth I bought at Walmart. And there's my dining room again. We have a huge dining room. So that's that. I hope you enjoyed it. I know it was a little shaky, but like I said, I'm doing the best that I can. I hope you all have a great day. Thank you for watching.